A common injury that we see, especially in our younger athletes, are ACL tears. This is unfortunately becoming increasingly more common despite uh, extensive research, extensive uh, focus on trying to prevent these injuries. We're seeing an increase in their incidence uh, as time goes on. And so more and more athletes and more and more weekend warriors are coming in with an ACL tear. And anyone that watches sports on TV knows of athletes getting ACL injuries, and they know that it can take a significant time to recover. The good news is that at the end of that recovery, most athletes can get back to their uh, participation in sports. Uh, while it takes surgery and an extensive physical therapy program to get there, usually individuals can get back to playing the activity that they want to do. A slightly less common injury is a PCL tear. A PCL tear uh, is not only not as common, but also does not always cause as much disability or dysfunction that an ACL injury does. It is not uncommon for someone to have a PCL tear and not even realize it until they've had a physical exam of their knee for a different reason. So while it is becoming more and more common for us to be uh, reconstructing ACL tears, uh, oftentimes a PCL injury does not require immediate surgery. Now, if we are going to predict if an athlete's gonna have an ACL tear or a PCL tear, by far the more common injury is the ACL injury. And most athletes know at least one teammate or other competitor who has had an ACL tear and they know what to expect. They know that if they wanna get back to playing sports, they're going to need to consider reconstructing that ligament. And then they know they have a up to nine month recovery and then they can try to return to their sport. A PCL tear does not follow that same script. Not all PCL tears need reconstruction. In fact, most PCLs can initially be managed non-operatively. We can often try to get a PCL uh, deficient knee better without surgery, and that can be with physical therapy, that can be with wearing a brace. And then for the individual who continues to have symptoms despite conservative treatment, we then consider a PCL reconstruction, which is the opposite script of an ACL. ACL tear. With an ACL tear, the initial thought is we need to get the knee ready so we can do surgery so that we can improve their chances of getting back to sports. If a PCL tear, we say, uh, well, we're going to try to get you better, and if we just can't, then we're going to reconstruct the ligament.